today we are going to be spending 2000 resin on our shell. All of the resin will be spent on artifacts because I already pre-farmed all of the materials that we need. Also, if you didn't see in the last video, we rolled for C1 R1 Chao, getting his weapon and getting two copies of him. So to start, we need to level him up. So I've already pre-farmed a lot of the mats, so we should be able to get him up a decent amount. I don't know if I have enough of everything to get him fully up, but I believe we should level 40. Okay, so we need six more of these. So we need to go craft these real quick. And also I want to level up his weapon before we go do that because I should have enough to get his weapon all the way up as well. Okay, we're also gonna need to craft this and I believe we don't have enough flowers as well. So I will be going to get the rest of the flowers that we need so that we can ascend Shao to max ascension and get his weapon all the way up. Okay, I think these should be the last ones that we need. Let's see, okay. There we go. I hope we have enough books. I think we should have enough books to get him all the way up. Okay, we do have enough books. Okay, good. Level 90, baby. Get our free pulls as well. Next, I mean, gotta unlock the constellation. Get that extra skull chart. There we go. Ah, oh, nice. And then talents are probably what we're gonna do next. So we're probably gonna split between alt and our auto tech not sure how much i can level them yet so we'll just level them as up as much as we can for now okay so we got him to seven six seven but i think we can get one more level if we go and craft some more books and eight six seven should be good enough for now i can always level that up later i mainly want to focus on getting artifacts today rather than focusing on talent so that should be better for us overall Okay, so this should be the last level here. I need to farm more boss mats, but I can do that as time goes on. I don't think I have any dream solvents, so unfortunately that's not gonna work either. I think before we start, let's go do a showcase without really any artifacts. And then after we do that, then we will showcase the damage difference with the artifacts. So let's go do that little miniature showcase real quick. Honestly, 23k for not having him built yet, I think that's pretty good. Because we're still going to be able to get a lot more stats on this. I mean, we only have 1,000 attack, or 1,900 attack. Uh, we have, like, no crit rate, no crit damage. There's a bunch more stuff we can get out of artifacts. So, hopefully... And yeah, we got 4-star attack feather. So, there's going to be a lot more we can get once we start farming Vermilion. So, let's go start farming Vermilion. So... We are currently about 500 resin in and I have gotten literally nothing. I got maybe like two usable pieces, but uh, simply, or to put it simply, the artifact look has been not been very good so far. But I mean, 5,000 resin is only a quarter of what we're going to spend, so we got some time to get some good pieces. We don't have to find anything perfect right away. Hey, okay. As long as we find stuff by the end. Oh my god. Finally, we got a good feather. This is actually really nice. I need a feather so bad. Okay, so we are currently about 1,000 resin in, and <laughs> the results still have not been really anything to worth talking about. I don't think I've gotten any really good pieces since I made the 500 resin update. I think I maybe got like one or two max, but yeah, I'd safe to say that the, these runs are not going too well in terms of the artifacts we're getting, which, it, I mean, it happens. Uh, I haven't really been too lucky with artifacts on this account, or just in general, so it's nothing too surprising, but hopefully we can get our luck up a little bit more as time starts to go on. But as for that, only time will tell, so we shall see what happens. May we finally get a good piece. It has been, it has been ages. Years, eons, maybe. It has been. I'm getting a lot of decent Echoes pieces, but my Vermilion pieces have not been too good today. Wait, this piece is insane. This gets attack on it as well. Then it's just all insane stats. Well, that's probably the best piece we've gotten all night. Hope it rolls well. What the hell? Why can't I get this as a orange artifact why am i getting them as purples 
Oh, it's so unlucky. This is our last condensed. We have spent around 2100 resin, I think. I spent a little bit more than 2000, but this is the last one. And nothing. So, I think what we're going to do first is we are going to strongbox some artifacts, and then after we strongbox artifacts, then we will start to roll the artifacts that we got. Uh, we do have over 100 artifacts. Well, we have well over 100 artifacts, probably closer to like 200 artifacts that we can strongbox. So let's strongbox those first and then see what type of rolls we get on them. Now it is time to do strongbox. We have about 200 or so artifacts to use on the strongbox. So we are going to see what we can get. Uh, make sure we're doing vermilion. We have a bunch of artifacts as you can see here. And we're going to strongbox. Okay, let's see. And we really need an animo damage goblet, but not not like this. I'll lock it anyway still, but it's not too good. This could grow good. Okay. This, okay, this has a lot of potential. We like that. I mean, this could also run decent. Pack, crit ray. Crit ray, it's no crit damage subs on that, which sucks, but I'll keep them just in case. Crit ray, crit damage flower. Okay, we take that as well. Very good. First time. Okay. So, second one. I believe we'll be able to do about five of them. Nothing. Crit damage. Also crit damage. Okay, yeah, some decent pieces there, but nothing too crazy. Okay, nothing too good there. We have about one and a half more, I believe, or two more almost. Hydro damage. I have so many good hydro damage goblets on this account. I have like three with crit rate crit damage on it. I've seen an anima one, but I've been really unlucky on the anima pieces. That's good. That could be good. Give me a circlet, please. Uh, lots of pieces that could roll well, but when it comes to like circlet, goblet, and that type of stuff, we are not getting super lucky. Okay, let's see. Goblet. DM, nah. If I wasn't to attack percent, it could be fine. Super cope though. This could be good. Kind of failed in like a lot of ways on that though. One last one. Animo. We're getting. We're just dodging animo goblets at this point. This is just unlucky. One day I'll get a good animo goblet for sure. Surely. Okay. Do I have any good animo goblets actually? I need to check. We have this, which is not good. We have this, which if it rolls an ER, could be fine. I might have to use something like this. Honestly, I might have to use a four-star animal goblet. We're going to use an attack goblet if I have any. I do have this. If this rolls in the crit damage, could be good. Okay, we'll start with the flowers. See what we can get. We'll start with the good pieces first. Okay, this is the best best potential piece that we have. Let's see? Good start. Again? Uh, flat pack is not good. Do I have any, like, plus 20s? Because I would rather just plus 20 this. Plus 18. What is this? Oh, this piece sucks. Okay, we can use that, and then we'll do we'll do these. Get it up there. Oh, 14% crit rate. Wait, what? I have 37, oh, 37 crit damage value piece. Wait, that's actually a really good start. 14 crit rate. Dang. Luckily, it didn't roll into HP. That's good. Honestly, I don't even think I'm going to level up any more of my flowers right now. Just kind of want to save my fodder for my other pieces, but we might come back to it after. I want to I wanna roll these first. Okay, so we got this, this, four of the good pieces, this, and this okay let's roll the let's roll this one first the big the big boy start off good it was a mineral but i'll take it regardless we take those attack okay good as long as this doesn't roll in the flat hp okay wait this could actually be in the crazy piece as long as no mm, no if it had no flat hp rolls it would be so good It'd be such a good piece i mean that one flat hp duo doesn't ruin it but still please good damage why does it roll in the flat hp that actually just ruined that piece. It could have been so good. Oh, that's so dumb, man. Why does it roll in the flat HP? Uh, I'll, I'll just, I'll roll the rest of these and see what the re rest of these ones. These are these plus 15, this tray. Flat HP, okay, the curse of flat HP is actually upon us today. Dude, one, four flat HP rolls in a row. What, what, what? Are you serious? Oh, I'm gonna go to 16. I just want to see if it rolls in the flat HP again. Yeah, this piece sucks anyways. This piece is so much better than that, yeah. Oh, I just switched to it. I meant to unlock it. Okay, we still have some... This piece should be god tier. Honestly, it's gonna give me attack. It's gonna give me attack here. It's gonna go all the rules. Um, even if this gets another curl, I think it still is ass. Wait, what is our other piece at? Even if I got another curl, it's still pretty bad. Like, it has ER on it, but I don't... I'd rather, I think I have ER on a lot of my other pieces anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Um, hello, this. See what this goes into? 
just just force sand everything. Might as well. Um, no, it's bad. There's, yeah, there's no way that goes good. So one lucky. Yeah, I can get crit damage on this. Okay, blue is gone. Okay, do this. Sacrifice. Why is there so much EM on this? I don't think Xiao needs EM, does he? I mean, if you're swirling, but I don't have a character to swirl with, so I'm not gonna trash that piece. So I'll keep it just in case. But I think the attack one's better. A lot of HP is actually so cursed, man. Okay, so for our flowers, we got this and this. I think honestly, the flat HP makes it look bad, but it's still decent. It still has three rolls and the useful stats. I think, wait, how much does the default attack roll? Maybe two rolls. Two rolls in HP less than the other stuff, so I'll take that. Okay, so attack sands. Okay, we don't have too many chances with attack sands. Please give me crit damage. Uh, unlucky. Okay, this needs crit damage. Why, why are you being so rude to me, man? I mean, I could just roll both of those and see which one does better. I swear, gladiator sands are always so good for some, like, no reason. Wait, why does the HP sands get double crit? So dumb. This game hates me. Yeah, this game definitely does hate me. It gave me crit rate on echoes. But, I mean, I could use it as an off piece. Um, if I do, do use, like, an on-set anima goblet with the four-star one I got, it's probably what I'm going to end up using anyways. No, this is going to give me double crit. It's going to be an insane piece. Uh, that's not double crit. However, if it will give me crit one more time, I'd be very happy. So, uh, 28 CV. It's better than what we have right now, but it's an off piece. That's our issue. I'm still going to roll these two. Uh, this is bad. I'm going to run an ER sands. Could level this up. Here this goes. It gets crit rate. Be good. Well, that's unlucky. Uh, war. We will run this piece up. Run it up. Run it back. Only one chance to hit crit rate. Wait, does this one have attack return on it? Crit rate, ER. Okay, now we roll the circlets. Uh, this is bad. 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 Oh, yeah, we have to get a lucky roll here. Crit damage, please. Okay, I didn't want it anyways. Crit rate. Give me crit rate, please. Poor fa, war. Poor fa. And I could be not fine, honestly. That's still <laughs> pretty bad. Give me a useful stat. Why are none of these stats useful at all? I think four default subs is not a good thing. Especially in this situation. And like why do i get why are my four stars better than my five stars like this had crit damage on it it was five stars could have been so much better 26 107.4 so we'll have like 150 or like 80 over 150 okay 70 over 150 that's still better than i expected we got 133 er you don't really need that much er because you have c1 yeah now we can level this up because this will give us more crit rate it'll give us like four more crit rate rate for leveling it up all the way i think this lag so bad makes me lose the game. Okay, so we can get this to 90. So that will bring our crit rate up to 70. Yeah, 72 over 157. And it will get better because I'm gonna keep on farming this uh, even in the future for sure. Okay, now it is time to see what only 2000 resin on artifacts has been able to do to our shell. So before I think we were hitting for around 28K plunges before. So, Hopefully we can see a much bigger number this time than the time before. I'm expecting maybe like um, 40k maybe. I'm not too sure exactly. I don't think it would be like um, that much of a difference. Okay. So what we are going to do. Let me do. Well, actually I don't really need to do that because I already have my stuff back. So I guess we can do this. This, 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 okay. 42k? Pretty decent damage, at least compared to before. It was, it's nearly double what it was before. Because before it was like 20 something thousand or something. I don't remember exactly what it was. It was like 20, 25k. So it's a lot more this time, which is good. So that is it for today's video. In our next video, we will be building Shen Yun and then doing a showcase with uh, Xiao and Shen Yun after we get the entire team built. Um, I'm also probably going to level up my Farazon a bit more before that video. So we will be back once that happens. So if you guys want to see that video, then be sure to sub to the channel. And if you enjoyed this video, also sub to the channel. And I will see you guys in the next video.